Hardly anyone will be surprised by our statement that adventure fans are experiencing a sharp price in demand. Because who wouldn't want to get as far away from the lockdowns as possible? Today we'll cover the newest 4x4 machines within the segment that capitalize on the improvements of the latest van chassis by Mercedes, Ford and VW. Off-roading in a large camper van in 2021 is totally possible. Stick around till the end and we'll prove this to you. Subscribe to Must See Tech not to miss any upcoming overlanding videos and let's roll! Winnebago Revel Though the Revel is not an all-new model, this year it is enjoying a host of updates that are aimed at making the van even more comfortable. First, the electrical system is improved tremendously. There are two 125Ah lithium iron phosphate batteries, a 2kW inverter and solar panels. The AC is upgraded, so now you can run it on electric power alone for an hour. The galley has a redesigned layout and is fitted with new cabinetry from folded aluminum. Finally, the fresh water tank is moved inside the van and there is a new LCD panel to control heating. As usual, the Ravel comes built on the Sprinter chassis with a 3-liter turbo diesel and it features a two-person floor plan with a power lift bed that creates a gear garage in the rear. La Strada Nova M 21 and shorter than its Nova EB sibling, the M van takes advantage of the same one-piece monocoque body construction and uses the latest Sprinter underpinnings with standard rear-wheel drive or optional all-wheel drive. Despite being smaller, the Nova M has enough space for three people. The rear houses a single cot, while at the front there is a collapsible queen bed. The camper van also fits a fully-fledged bath with a collapsible sink and a mini kitchen packing all the necessities. A mini couch and a table create a compact dining area, while front seats can swivel in case you have company during lunch. Finally, to make sure the van offers plenty of headroom, the roof of the M is raised by 6 inches in comparison with the stock high-roof Sprinter. Outside Van Explorer This custom van is built around the 2019 Sprinter with 170 EXT wheelbase, which means that it is extremely spacious inside. The Explorer's interior package includes a 3M Thensulate full insulation, marine grade plywood floor and LED overhead lighting. For longer stays, Outside Van's designers fitted the van with a full galley kitchen with a recessed induction cooktop, two adjustable swiveling tables a convertible bed and a removable rear shower. The conversion targets real off-grid adventure, so the van is fitted with two 300Ah lithium batteries, a 2000W magnum inverter and a 180W rooftop solar system. In addition, there is a secondary alternator that charges the batteries while the engine is running. Smash the like button if overlanding is your life's philosophy and leave a request in the comment section for the future videos on our channel. Let's keep going! Heimer Crossover 4x4 We are already familiar with Heimer's 4x4 Grand Canyon S camper van and MLT 570 Class C motorhome, which are both based on the latest Sprinter. But Germans felt compelled to expand their off-roading lineup with a more prepared crossover edition. The newcomers rely on the Mercedes selectable 4 ETS electronic all-wheel drive with a reduction gear and benefit from a 3.5-inch suspension lift kit. The 2021 enhancements come in the form of 16-inch all-terrain wheels, front LED light bars, a vibrant paint scheme and an off-road survival kit. Plus, the larger of the two MLT 570 also gets a roof rack, ladder and a spare tire holder. These campers promise 10 day all year round self sufficiency, ensured by a 90 watt solar system, two 135 Ah lithium, 95 Ah LED batteries, and a heavy duty 6 kW diesel heater. Toyota 
Turek Bruce Banner Just like Bruce Banner was a scrawny nuclear physicist before turning into the Hulk, the Turek van began as an ordinary two-wheel drive cargo van but was transformed into a hardcore adventure machine. The stock drive shafts and axles were replaced with a solid axle for wheel drive setup with locking differentials and 3 to one a low-range transfer case. This borderline expedition vehicle gets backwards bumpers, side steps, ladder and a roof rack with pathfinder lighting. The exterior is covered with full body line X protection coating, there are black rhino armory rims, terror wagon snorkel and a total of 8.5 inches lift. The Turek Bruce Banner is equipped with a full stainless shower with a portable toilet, shield seats, diesel cooktop, 85 liter isotherm fridge and 65 liter freezer, hydronic heat and hot water, plus a 600 ampere hour lithium battery. Carmen Mobile Dexter 574x4 And the new all-train camper by the German converter Carmen Mobile offers an optimal package for a spontaneous adventure for two travelers. The Dexter takes advantage of the Ford Transit chassis and has the total length of 19.5 feet. The base engine is an economical Euro 60 compliant 2-liter diesel with 130 horsepower. The sequential four-wheel drive and the ruggedized tires are here to cope with questionable roads and weather conditions. The Dexter 574x4 has a practical seating group with swiveling captain chairs, a miniaturized kitchen with a two-flame cooker and an 80-liter fridge. At your disposal are a combi four diesel heater, cassette toilet, an integrated shower and outlets across all major types. Traka Jabiru J2M All-Wheel Drive In production since the late 1990s, the Jabiru from the Australian Traka has always been built on the Sprinter chassis. So, with the arrival of the new generation model in 2019, the camper moved to the updated underpinnings. The newest member of the refreshed Jabiru family is the mid-wheelbase J2M model with all-wheel drive. It is designed to accommodate two travelers with any road conditions and terrains thanks to its selectable all-wheel drive with low transfer case and raised suspension ensuring 8.27 inches of ground clearance. Additionally, the van can be optioned with underbody protection and 17-inch alloys with either all-terrain or mud tires. As standard, there is a fully functional bathroom area and an aisle kitchen. Plus, the model is equipped with a remote package featuring a 200W solar system and a 200 ampere hour lithium battery. Norva Kitsun 4x4 This camper from the Canadian Quebec-based company Norva targets those customers who need to carry lots of gear when getting off the beaten path. Underpinned by the Mercedes-Benz Sprinter 4x4 chassis, the Kitsun comes standard with premium four-season insulation, which is covered by sustainable poplar paneling to save on vehicle's weight. To secure gear, the van is equipped with numerous bags, hangers, side racks and bicycle ground anchors. The key interior feature, however, is Norva's Chameleon 5-section bed. In case of need, it disassembles completely to free up the center aisle, while its modules can be used to create a U-shaped sofa, a dual bench, a day bed and even serve as a workbench. Vanworks Max Trax The Portland's UK Vanworks is positioning itself as the one-stop custom builder for anyone looking for a VW certified camper. The brand's all-new Max Trax van is taking advantage of the renewed Crafter platform in two wheelbase lengths with the high top. The off-grid adventurers get more interior space and available two and four fixed bed layouts with a luxury mattress, full lining, heating, hot water and electrics. The two-person model comes with a wet bath, while the four-sleeper gets a cassette toilet and an outdoor shower. 
The Max Trucks interior is decorated with a VW Classic upholstery and is fitted with a tiny sink, a two-burner cooktop and a fridge. The camper comes powered by a 2-liter diesel engine with either 140 or 170 horses, gets a 4-motion all-wheel drive with a differential lock and rides on BF Goodrich tires. Matera Camper Vans Pop Top Classic Based in Jackson, Wyoming, Matera Camper Vans has several camper models that they rent out on a daily or weekly basis for those people who would like to experience a bit of van life for themselves. The company's Pop Top Classic model features a pop up roof, which adds to nearly 8 foot of interior height. At night, provides a sleeping area for two, while another double bed is located below. The latter also converts into a bench seat with three seat belts. The Sprinter conversion also comes equipped with numerous amenities as standard. There is a galley kitchen with a portable stove, an outdoor shower, a Thad Ford porta potty toilet, and a self contained solar electricity system. Besides, the company provides all essentials that you might need during your trip, from cooking utensils or towels, and all the way to marshmallow roasting skewers. Would you say that a four-wheel drive is a vital component of a camping van? And what platform is the most optimal for conversions in your opinion? Let's discuss this in the comment section. Smash the like button and subscribe to Musty Tech for all of your van life content. Ring the bell and proceed to watching more by following the links on the screen. See you soon!